local parents are now suing a judge in Warren County in federal court. Those parents say that Judge Joseph Kirby isn't allowing transgender teens to be able to change their name. Well, Nine on your side's Evan Millward spoke with those parents today. This lawsuit says Judge Joseph Kirby is treating transgender teens differently in court in a county once forced to talk about transgender issues because of tragedy. Judge Kirby's courtroom isn't far from a stretch of highway named for Leela Alcorn, the transgender teen who took her own life here in 2014. I mean, everybody already knows 40% uh, chance of suicide. Jennifer and Jeff Shaw say they're still on a journey of learning and accepting their transgender teen. Well, the questions that we are constantly getting are, oh, could it be a fad? Could it be a phase? Um, I can tell you with not a doubt, it, it's not a fa fad. They've applied for a name change for their transgender son and are now part of a lawsuit against Judge Kirby. My view is the parents do not want their children to have to go through a hearing where they won't be treated. Um, fairly and the same as any other child. Kylan Whitaker says he's seen it firsthand, fighting to change his transgender son's name in Warren County. It was denied almost identically to two others this year. His 15-year-old told to wait three more years. We have permits coming up. We have driver's license. Uh, you can't change a social security number or a birth marker without the legal name change and that is blocking all this. Attorney Josh Langdon says Judge Kirby asked inappropriate and irrelevant questions during that hearing, focused on which restroom the child used and if he was inspired by Caitlyn Jenner. He says this is happening in other Ohio counties too, as more parents approve of name changes. As people start to understand their rights and they start to understand that um, there, there is this option to make life easier for your children. In this case is in the early stages. It was just filed today. In the meantime, one of the families in this case will be right back here for a name change hearing in a little more than a week. We'll be following it. In Lebanon, I'm Evan Millward, 9 on your side.